be seated. All right, let's continue uh, with our children's message. And, uh, you know, my favorite, uh, as you know, my favorite Disney movie when I was little was Dumbo. Um, because I loved his big ears, right? And kids, that's what we're going to talk about today. Children on the, on the screen, I know you see me. I see, well, I don't see you, but you see me. And um, I have a picture of what? What are these? Do you have, do you have these on your body? What are they called? <laughs> yes. They're not that big on your body, are they? Do you, do you have big ears this big, anyone? Actually, if, I wish we kind of did. Then we could hear better, right? If we had bigger ears. I mean, they would probably be hard to put our glasses around and it'd be tough. But, <laughs> but uh, ears, why are ears so important? Why are ears so important? Because with ears, we can, starts with an H, ends with an R, it's a verb. Hear, we can hear, right? See, the question, kids, today is this. What do you hear all throughout the week? You don't have to get too specific. <laughs> but what do you hear? You might hear your teachers teaching you. Uh, you might hear, who else? Your parents, right? Telling you it's time for dinner or, or do your homework or get up, it's time for school or, or um, what else do they say? <laughs> they say a lot of different things. Or, you know, when you turn on the, um, the remote on the TV, you're hearing all the different TV shows that you listen to or watch, right? We're always listening to something, right? So the question is, when we come to church on Sunday, why do we come? Why do we come to church? It always reminds me of years, right? Because as we hear God's word, you know, we go out throughout the, the whole week and we hear so many different things. But this is that very moment where as children of God, whether you're um, 7, 8, 9, or 10, or whether you're 80 or 90 years old, this is, this is why we're here. To hear the words of the Good Shepherd. Right? Like, my television shows usually don't tell me about the Good Shepherd. Or my, for you kids, your video games probably don't tell you about the Good Shepherd. But when you come to the church, here you listen and receive the words of the Good Shepherd. The words of Jesus. And that's why we come. To hear the words of what he has done for each and every one of you. To hear the words that, yeah, though we are sinful, right? Though we are sinners, it is Jesus our Lord who dies for our sins. You know, children, you know, when you, when you continue to grow up and when you're my age or when you're your parents' age or whatever age you may be, this is the word that you always need to hear. This is the word of Christ that you always need to hear. And I know everyone here who is older can attest to that because you very well know that this is the word that throughout all the things that you listen in life, here we are together hearing the words of Jesus, the cross, the empty tomb, the death and resurrection of our Lord. And friends, children, this is the precious time, a most important time as you listen, because this is what you need to hear time and time again. Jesus, as he forgives you of all of your sins. Let us pray. Dearly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for these children Bless them in the one true faith and grant them ears to hear. Lead them by your voice in the one true faith and through all things. Bless them and comfort them in your light of your word. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.